Hello, welcome back to What A Movie. I am Tony. And I'm Kyle. And we're back for more of The Office. Ooh. Last time... Was? <laughs> I've got a... Oh my god, what was <laughs> What was the last time? Uh, ben Franklin! Oh, yes! Yeah. The president. The president. <laughs> yeah. Um, it was like a little... Kind of... Ooh, where we see Pam going on her date. <laughs> what was that? Well, she just kind of asked to be set up. Yeah, but with would, someone. Would the date be yeah. on this one? It was all so awkward. Pam was so awkward last yeah. time, but yeah, um, yeah, it was an interesting one. It's all in the lead up to season what? three, episode sixteen, Phyllis's wedding. Oh, his head on the eighth of February two thousand seven, directed by Ken Whittingham, and uh, written by Carolina Williams. I don't think we've seen that writer before. It'd be really nice to see them out of an office situation. Yeah, something a bit different. They don't go out of it too often, but sometimes they do, yeah. and it's been good. Last time was probably Diwali. Um, maybe, yeah. Uh, uh, Travelling salesman, they went out for a little bit. Yeah. It's still um, work-related, though. Yeah, it? yeah. So, yeah, I think that's maybe the last one. Yeah. But there we go. Uh, we shall see. Um, full reactions in the description. Need your own copy to watch along. Just make sure to come back. We'll talk all about it. Let's just go. Oh. Oh, did you want to say something? Well, you usually ask me what I think is going to happen, and I was going to say it. a wedding. Well, let's just get on with it. <laughs> your little sarcasm. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, it's another file to reboot again. Hey, Dwight, do you want an Altoid? What do you think? <laughs> of course. <laughs> In school, we learned about this scientist who trained dogs to salivate at the sound oh. of a bell, feeding them whenever a bell rang. The last couple of weeks, I've been conducting a similar experiment. <laughs> so every time. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Is he gonna like instinctively? Altoid. Sure. <laughs> I'm gonna do this at work to someone. Entwine. Entwine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> My mouth tastes so bad all of a sudden. <laughs> God. We haven't seen him messing with Dwight properly for what a little bit. What are you going to do to someone? Um, every time a noise happens, I'll do something. Every time the door alarm goes off. <laughs> Frutella? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or, um, I don't know. Oh, you're right to buy me a can from the tuck shop. <laughs> and then eventually I'll be like, <laughs> they'll just be buying me. <laughs> like, surrounded in cans. Always oh, oh. the bridesmaids, right, ladies? For this next one, everybody hop out. Let's bring mom back in and the sisters and you and you and you. <laughs> just not you. <laughs> Is getting asked me to push her father's wheelchair down the aisle. So basically, yeah, I'd... that's a pretty big honor. Since I pay her salary, it is like I am paying for the wedding. But it's an even bigger day for me. <laughs> Employer of the bride. <laughs> yeah, I put Michael in my wedding. Why? It was the only way I could think to get six weeks off from my honeymoon. <laughs> no, no Phyllis fair. ended up using the exact same invitations as Roy and me. <laughs> so, yeah, I like being invited to my own wedding. And I was like, thought I called that off. <laughs> yeah. Now you're what stuck. A toaster. You? A uh, toaster? Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> well, what else do you get? Hello, it's got to be a toaster. Hi, Dwight. You look as beautiful as the Queen of England. Oh, thank you. Mm. Don't forget, <laughs> break left. Left. <laughs> <laughs> the have their own traditions. We usually marry standing in our own grave. The funeral is very romantic. I, I don't. are a bleak affair. Nice. Yeah. Our... Phyllis and Robert. Also, Pam and Roy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say R. I was trying to work out his name, yeah, and I was like, <laughs> "As beautiful as the first day you started work at Dunder Mifflin." Thanks, Michael. It mm. was when you said it outside. You excited? Did you need to vomit? That is okay. I did. Do you want to talk about tonight? No, you're probably worried about pleasing Bob. A lot of uh, <sighs> Michael. Did you hear break wind? <laughs> it's okay. It's a very natural reason. <laughs> it's your wedding. You're nervous. That wasn't me. Okay. <laughs> For God's sake. Sure 
Good Bob. Wow, that is. <laughs> that is pungent. Um, <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> Let me. Michael. Oh, no, my God. I don't need your ball <laughs> <pitch. No. sighs> I just need some time alone. Okay. Okay. Just get out of here. Leave her alone. to one other wedding. My mom was marrying Jeff. Asked me to be ring bearer. Somehow, my pants became wet. Uh. I hate you! Long story short, <gasps> Jeff's dog wedding. ended up as <laughs> And the irony is that Much better the job. ceremony, that dog peed on everything. And nobody said boo. Well, well, there's a reason. <laughs> we need a new plague. Oh my god, <laughs> when was this room? Well, I remember a wedding crasher. Did you ever see that movie? I saw a wedding crashers accidentally. Bought a ticket for Grizzly Man and went into the wrong theater. Oh. After an hour, I it always happens. The theater, but I kept waiting. That's the thing about bear attacks. You know? <laughs> <laughs> <God>. <laughs> I wish I had the investigative powers. Mm -hmm. I will take care of it's this. So close. I will locate the wedding crashers. <laughs> Report them to Phil. So that way I won't have to get her again. Mm. Hi, I'm Kevin. Where'd you find her? At the gym. Right. <laughs> the gym. <laughs> Kevin's so skinny. You're on my dress. You're not supposed to wear white to a wedding. I know, but there was an emergency. I look really good in white. <laughs> This That's the emergency. Go on. Mm. His father, Albert, and he is quite the ladies' man. Ring bear. I could have done better. Mm, nah. I will do better. I am going to be better. What is he gonna do? What if he pees his pants? He's gonna pee his <laughs> I am. <laughs> you just gotta walk. Literally all you gotta do. What if you come running? <laughs> That's my dress. What? <laughs> so she just copied her wedding? I guess so. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> nice. Take away Michael's the, yeah. big moment. <laughs> nice. That's nice for her though and him. Yeah. This is bullshit. <laughs> You're so salty. Supposed to be the highlight of the wedding. Now the wedding has no highlight. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Because he forgot how to... What? I can't believe I pushed that lazy ass around all day. <sighs> Stand up and steal the show. Jesus. I got news for you, Albert. That's your real name. It's not over. <laughs> Don't do anything else. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you even invite him, to be honest? <laughs> He's trying to push in! <laughs> God. <laughs> He's such a baby. What is cre- is he just- Still in someone's present? Just... <laughs> <laughs> the biggest one Bob as well. Vance refrigeration <laughs> God. That is full name. Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, may I present to you... <laughs> and do you, Bob, take Phyllis to be... <laughs> I did it too early. Yeah. Don't do it again. Ladies and gentlemen, for the first time as a couple, Mr. and Mrs. Bobby! Just... My God. <laughs> he... Has to be sent over attention. He sh huh? Has to be sent over to Yeah, he should not be allowed in public. Lovely. Dress is very white. Mm. Eyes are burning. She has to say something. Yeah. If you ever lay a finger on Phyllis, I will kill you. If you ever lay a finger on Phyllis, I'll kill you. Fingers will be laid on Phyllis. Decide to sit down again, huh? Great. Bet you can hear me too. Jesus Christ. I need to see the guest manifest. I don't have that white. Damn it, <laughs> I would not have invited any of these people. This is so awful for you. What do you mean? This was supposed to be your wedding. It's actually fine. If I was you, I would just like freak out and get really drunk and then tell someone I was pregnant. Hey, a lot of good ideas. Take a note not to do that, maybe. Is she gonna end up doing that? 
Why are you staring at this poor man just getting some bread? How do you know the happy couple? Who? The bride and groom. <laughs> oh, I, I don't. But I get it. Come on, I... freeloader, let's move it. Okay, where are we going? <laughs> gotta find this... way. I bet he's like a <laughs> uncle or something. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you find your seat and dry the buffet? Chicken, totally undercooked. I sent it back. It's fish. I will take care of that. <laughs> I do. I know a fair amount about fine food and drink. Clearly. This is a white. Well done. This is not our first wedding. Oh, this yeah. Wedding He's performing. Crazy. Wait, but Pam was going to get them as well. So yeah. Our wedding. And our guitarist's wedding. What about yours? Uh, attention, <laughs> uh, I'm supposed to ask if anyone has seen Uncle Al. I called it. He has yes. brown eyes and dementia. Dementia, I do it. <laughs> it's a very serious situation. <laughs> I was gonna say he had dementia as well. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. This is the person you want to see. I notice these kind of things, but uh, this wedding's really nice. This has got some great taste. You're kidding me, right? I know you probably aren't going to remember this, but uh, I uh, got you those color roses for our prom. I picked those flowers. Phyllis just stole all of my ideas for our wedding. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I wasn't involved in the plan. Not paying attention. Ooh, that's a bit open, isn't it? Yeah. I think this sucks for you. I'm the one who actually wanted to get married. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> This poor guy! <laughs> He's just out in the wilderness. Why is this gonna end up killing him? <laughs> you're a wonderful woman. And you're a hell of a bowler. <laughs> Thank you, Randy. That was great. I can't. I gotta walk out of here. <laughs> Why? Uh, this man. Do you not like them when they're at the office? No. I am going to be your tour guide. One of the great, seemingly impossible love stories. Can we switch off this stories. microphone? <laughs> this one. My name is Michael Scott. <laughs> Webster's Dictionary defines wedding the fusing of two metals with a hot torch. It's <laughs> welding. What? I think you guys are two metals, gold medals. <laughs> For those of you who don't know me, I'm Michael Scott, Phyllis's boss. To quote from The Princess Bride. <laughs> Oh gosh. Marriage! The most important part of a speech <laughs> is the opening line. When time is not a factor, I like to try out three or four different ones. Lewis <laughs> and Bob, their celebrity couple name God. would be Flob. <laughs> you look at her. And, and you she, think. Back in high school, her nickname oh was Easy Rider. Now, as for Bob, <laughs> Bob Vance. <laughs> Is a guy Thanks. that Thanks, give me he works. Mind. Okay, hold on. I didn't say anything. Mm. His dad upstaged me. I think you owe me this. <laughs> this guy is just okay, good. You're beat out him out with it. You're out of here. You're beat him I with it. You. <laughs> 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 huh? Bloody baby. <laughs> Pam looked kind of happy about yeah. it though, in a way. I mean, it's something to talk about, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. When are we gonna get to see some of those famous Beasley dance moves? <laughs> I'm pacing myself. Get out there. Give the people what they want. Oh, I'm such a dorky dancer. I know. <laughs> it's very cute. Don't say that, Jim. Mm. I thought Pam was interested. Then, no, it's totally mm. hypothetical. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. Oh, for God's sake. Come on. I can't let you in, Michael. To quietly sit and have a piece of cake. You are a real life it's wedding gonna... crasher, and I must bounce you. Yeah. No pleasure. I've always got to cut to him doing crazy dancing. She said at Jim and Karen dancing. Yeah. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> She's going to end up dancing with Roy. Today, you know. <laughs> 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 It's a really touching <laughs> moment there. <laughs> God's sake. She so gonna get drunk. Playing our song, huh? I thought they only played the police. I gave him 20 bucks. <laughs> you wanna dance? I call that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> I was thinking then, like, where have they gone? <laughs> mm. Michael all alone. He will never learn. <laughs> he will never learn. No. Hey, you want to get out of here? Mm. Wow. Damn. I mean, what else yeah. do you expect, really? Here's a non hypothetical. I'm really happy I'm with Karen. Every little thing she does. One cut. Michael's gonna catch it. No, it's gonna be. Yeah, yeah, you saw that. I thought it was gonna be her then. <laughs> <laughs> For God's sake. Tell us you will be great together. <laughs> we are great together. We are a great team. Celtics were a great team. <laughs> My God. Ryan Smack and that was so good. I should talk to her. I don't want this to ruin her honeymoon. Nobody ever helped me. I had to do it myself. Dude, keep it together. I listen to you for half an hour. <laughs> Most of that stuff went right over my head. Oh. <laughs> Phyllis, mm. I'm sorry. He's starting to go out. Yeah, he's kind of a weirdo. <laughs> oh. Mm. <You're> <laughs> kind of worked out then. Yeah. You're lucky if you can get a piece of your own cake. I say, let them eat cake. Margaret Thatcher said that. <laughs> Did she? Smart broad. <laughs> well. Be careful. Oh, no! Come on! You look like a clown. Here. Oh, get me. Get me. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I can't handle this. <laughs> He's so <Yeah>. awful. <laughs> <laughs> Just every like special moment he had yeah. to ruin. <laughs> oh, there we go. Phyllis's wedding. I swear, Michael Scott gets even more awkward in unoffice situations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I said. Like we got so used to his cringe with the people he works with. Yeah. So it's kind of like, a, oh, they're used to it. We're used to it. Yeah. Kind of. So like when the Scranton or the Stanton branch, yeah, right, like merged it got a bit more awkward and then like stuff like this where you put it in front of other people is just like oh <laughs> just makes it even more cringy of course he had to try and make it all about him yeah get in the way he's only been to one wedding before previously Which and he peed mother. himself yeah. <laughs> of and then course. got replaced by a dog yeah <laughs> when the little kid it. walked past he's like i could do a better job than that. Yeah. you can even push Wow. Okay, so when he when the dad gets out of the wheelchair to actually walk her down the aisle. Yeah, which is really nice and big moment. Yeah. Like, yeah. I remember that with um someone I know. She I don't even know what was she had foot issues. Yeah. They're better now, like she's had some operations, but her foot was basically bending inwards. Okay. Um, and they didn't know what the issue was uh -huh. and stuff. And she was on crutches for a long time. But that was the one thing she said on her wedding day, she wanted to walk down that aisle, yeah. not with crutches. Afterwards, yeah. But the initial, like... Yeah, yeah. The aisle walk. Yeah, that's the whole point of this. Yeah. The dad walk, it was a big deal. And it's yeah. like, oh, that's really nice. And like, then you get him... Making it all to, about him. Unable to push a wheelchair with nobody in it. Yeah, he just made it about himself. Yeah. The way he tried <sighs> to get in front of that person and, like, push him out. Like, <laughs> he did get in front of them. Yeah, he did. <laughs> and then after Phyllis said, I do, and he was like, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. <laughs> and everyone's like... <laughs> Like, uh, Bob. <laughs> I like how he said Bob Vance of Vance Refrigeration. Yeah, that is his whole name. It's like on his legal name. Yeah. I can't, like, how they just copied Pam and Roy's wedding. Yep. Like, the invitations, the, the flowers, flowers, the, the music, dress. the dress, everything. Yeah. I love the bit where Roy is like, these flowers are like, he. You won't believe this did not pay any attention no. in any of the wedding Yeah, because like, you won't believe this. I, those are the colour of the flowers I gave to you at prom. And she's, <laughs> she's like, like really? I picked those. <laughs> like, they copied our wedding. I like how we... The Roy Buck moment with her was nice. It was nice. Like, he paid yeah. 20 bucks because they only play one... The police. The police, yeah. yeah. Type of song. Um, 
say gave them 20 bucks to play their song yeah, it's so really yeah. nice it was cute though because yeah. I did think where are they going to dance and yeah they was... didn't want people to see because it's a big deal yeah it? then like... it was cute when the camera panned out and there was Dwight and Angela dancing yeah, as well and, yeah. like, oh. and then Michael on oh, his own <laughs> <laughs> the speech my god yeah. like uh... easy rider and then, like, like he said, he, he usually there's a good ways to start a speech, and I noticed that because he's like he used the dictionary definition, yeah. which he got. He, made, he yeah. said welding, right? Welding. <laughs> welding. <laughs> so stupid. Um, and then there was like other ones, like oh, their their couple name would be, or yeah. back in high school, like he'd come up with all these different, but he did. He just done them all. Yeah. Flob. <laughs> Flob. Man. So. I can't, I can't believe I called that. Was the uncle. Yeah. That was like I just guessed. I was like, oh, that's gonna be a relation and he's got dementia. I didn't want to say dementia, yeah. but Yeah, there we go. God. <laughs> just Dwight thinking he's Dwight saying about the chicken being more and they're like it's No, that was Mike. Michael, yeah. Oh Michael. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I sent it back. <laughs> I like, do like the fact that Dwight ends up being on the door and like kicking Michael, Michael out. out. It's like, no, it's the yeah. request I can't <laughs> You're a wedding crasher. Yeah. Yeah. Because Jim got it into his mind. Yeah. Of course, we got the bit of the office actually, like at the beginning with the oh, uh, the mint. Yeah, it's like uh, training him yeah. to, when he hears the noise. Give him a. This mint. is the second episode in a row as well that we haven't seen Andy. Yeah, is and he? Like, is he gone? Is he like? I don't know. Is he taking some time off for Do his you think anger they, issues? Yeah, maybe he's like in anger management or something. Yeah, I think I saw a comment about anger management. I don't know if yeah. it was. Yeah. Can't remember because I replied to some. I read all the comments, so I but I kind of browse it, through sure them sometimes. I, yeah. I, I was like, uh, yeah, yeah, no, no, Andy. Yeah, I'm surprised she invited the amount of people from work as she did, but maybe she doesn't have many friends outside of work. Oscar wasn't there though. No, Oscar. But again, like, have these been like recorded in a different order from when Oscar maybe, returned? Yeah. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I'm not sure. It was just the main ones from the office, wasn't it? Oh, of course, bloody <sighs> Creed. No. <laughs> Who are you thinking of? Describe them. <laughs> Wearing the white dress. Kelly. Kelly. She's right there. You could have no, pointed her. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bloody wearing a white dress. Oh, there was an emergency. I look good in white. Yeah, of course. Uh, again, her. She's just like absorbed in her own little world. But it was funny. She? The bouquet toss. Oh, it's hilarious. <laughs> Ryan just smacked I was about to say, what if Kelly gets it? He <laughs> was going right for Kelly, yeah. and then Ryan just smacked <laughs> Hey, Toby's got a girlfriend. Yeah. yeah. Met at the gym. gym. Kevin's up. Like, <laughs> oh, that hilarious. Yeah. No. Um, Kelly obviously talking to Pab as well, saying, oh, you must feel really bad. This I would get, really if it was me, I'd get drunk and say I'm just pregnant or something. Yeah. It's like, oh, good, no, good ideas. She had a few to drink and has gone mm, home with yeah. the ex that she should have been marrying yeah don't know how that's gonna pan out pam out i don't know <laughs> <laughs> was pam was out yeah. she was out of it <laughs> yeah no it was sad because obviously you had a little moment with jim like where he was like oh when are we gonna see those beasley moves yeah she's like i'm cute. a dork when i dance yeah. he's like that's i think it's cute yeah and um, then they, him and Karen were dancing together. And, and she, she looked was, directly at him and he looked directly at her. And he looked sad. Yeah. And then Michael was hopping up at the window. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but she ended up dancing with Roy. Yeah. But yeah. Um, crazy episode. Creed. I like after swapping Jim, the presents. <laughs> yeah. I like after Jim seeing them walk off hand in hand together. He's like, hypothetically, I like Karen. <laughs> yeah, because before he's like, hypothetically, like, talking about Pam, like, it's not a thing. That's a hypothetical. It's not, yeah. yeah. And then obviously after that, yeah. And I like the cut to Karen <laughs> singing and dancing. God, yeah. Yeah. Crazy. There we go. Um, what will happen? I saw there? recently a, a um, an article about Rashida Jones. Mm -hmm. uh, Karen um, because it reminded me of The Office but the article was someone did an interview with her and commented that she looked tanned and didn't realise her ethnicity Yeah, and that is exactly what Michael did in the first episode yeah. he's like you look I can't remember you look exotic I think he yeah. said I don't know if it like what came first I think the interview was after that yeah. but yeah it's just like yeah it just reminded me of that like yeah just like there are real Michael Scotts out there. Yeah, <laughs> like, there you go. <laughs> there are people like this, but yeah, obviously they didn't mean harm by yeah. it, I guess. But it's still like, surely you would 
I don't know if you're interviewing someone, you do your research, but yeah. there you go, I don't know. Um, yeah, but yeah, she was being dorky. <laughs> but it's not the right type of dorky. <laughs> Uh, I love the, the Kevin part where he's like, um, we're looking for Uncle Whoever. Yeah. He's, he's old, he's got dementia. Really important. Really, really important, really serious. <laughs> it's just like playing like high pitch yeah. singing. And, yeah. There you go. He, he made it better with Phyllis at the end, though. Yeah. You found an uncle, whatever. Yeah. yeah. He didn't really, but yeah. And there we go. That was Phyllis's wedding. Yeah, what an episode. Um, I really enjoyed. Yeah. Man. Or I don't know what's going to happen with this whole love quadruple yeah, triangle yeah, whatever it is right now. Yeah, but there you go. I feel like Roy wasn't involved and now he's involved himself. Mm. Yes, yeah. There yeah. we go. Well, we've seen little bits of him talking to her over this season and like, yeah. yeah. There's been bits and moments. Um, I just remember that Angela making comments about her dress like, oh, yeah. she just doesn't, doesn't know when to shut up. Yeah. And Michael getting in the pictures at the beginning. Yeah. <laughs> God's sake. <laughs> yeah. But there we go. We'll be back for more Office next week. Uh, uh, yeah, thank you very much. Um, where will it go? We've only got a few more. Yeah. I don't know how many episodes is this season. Do, do, do. Right, just scroll down. Got a few more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, a lot more. Eight more. Not too much more. We're getting there. We're, yeah, we're two thirds of the way through. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you very much. We shall see you then. Hopefully less cringy. Hopefully. <laughs> but there we go. I've got hiccups. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Bye.